Some of you may remember last year I did a video on cooking steaks with a steak stone. And they work well enough, but since then these Himalayan salt plates have become popular. And in fact this is about half the cost of the steak stone was. So we're going to try to do the same thing here. We're going to try to cook up some steaks uh, using this salt plate. And actually I bought the salt plate itself plus actually a little carrying bag. This salt plate measures uh, 18 inches by 12 inches so it's a pretty good size and it does come with this metal frame to help hold it and it's a good inch and a quarter thick or so and it weighs about 20 pounds and there we go it does impart a slightly salty flavor to your meats and things that you put on here which is understandable after all it is natural salt so we're going to try it and compare it to the steak stone that we used last year and just see which we like better and in order to cook these steaks on the Himalayan salt stone, I'm going to be using my Fox Outfitters portable stainless steel camp grill, which I actually did a video on last year. And I'm just going to put the grill cover on, and then we'll put the salt stone on top of that once we get the fire started, just like that. And then we'll just uh, monitor the temperature with my infrared thermometer until it gets up to about 400 degrees and then we'll throw the steaks on. The instructions say that the Himalayan salt stone is very sanitary, naturally inhibits the development of microbes and requires no cleansers which includes soap. So all you're supposed to do is just wash it with warm water and scrub it lightly with a soft brush or sponge which I did and I've let it dry so we're ready to go I think. So we've been heating our stone for a while and we're about 270 degrees so we got a little while yet to go so it does take some time to heat up and I caution you not to heat this up too fast because you could crack it so we've been about 15-20 minutes so far we got maybe another 100 degrees to go so we're, we're heating it up just at about the right rate okay so we're substantially at about 400 degrees there 391 so I think we're ready we're going to slap the old steaks on here. I mean, we're close to 400 degrees, and that should be enough. Here we go. Yeah, it's pretty hot when it sizzles when you put them on there like that. I like that sizzle sound. Okay, steaks are off the grill. Got them over here on the picnic table, and it is just really, really tender. I just cannot describe how good these are. So, I think you ought to try this. I'm going to eat my dinner. And after it's cooled down, which can take a couple hours, uh, we just put this in the carrying bag that we bought for it. And unfortunately, the carrying bag does not have any place for the frame. But anyway, this will still keep the salt plate clean. <coughs> 